Hello Sagittarius, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Sagittarius, this is your reading for the month of uh, for the month of January 2022 and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Okay, Sagittarius, in this reading, we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you are dealing with, you are thinking about. And then I'll pull out some cards related to your related to your money, your career, and your finances. Okay, so let's get started now. Ooh, we have a ten of cups for you. We have a tower. Then we have a king of wands. For your person, we have his Eight of Cups, we have his Nine of Wands, and we have his Nine of Cups, okay? As far as your career, your money, and your finances are concerned, as far as your career, your money, and your finances are concerned, we have his Queen of Swords. Two of Swords, then we have his Death and Rebirth, okay, and we have a Seven of Swords, and last one is Page of Pentacles. All right. So this is your spread. We have Ten of Cups and Nine of Cups in one spread. Nice. So Ten of Cups. Tower and King of Wands for you, Sagittarius. Sagittarius with that King of Wands, uh, what I feel is that you are someone, Sagittarius, who is a very hardworking person. You are someone who uses your passion, your energy for the right reasons and for the right purposes okay you do not waste your energy you do not waste your passion and you do not waste your time okay people around you are watching you grow people around you are watching you rise up in your life people around you are are very sure that uh if not today someday this person is going to achieve a lot of success in their life okay and like yes even as of now you are wherever you are you're happy uh, with yourself you're satisfied and you're content and you ooze that that confidence you ooze that uh, you know whenever people talk with you there is they get some sort of an assurance that uh, you are the person who's going to succeed in your life okay they they draw that kind of conclusion whenever they talk with you okay and because of that what is happening is uh sagittarius many people are watching you many people are uh you are on the watch list of many people okay why you are on the watch list of many people because they are watching you grow they are watching you rise up they they are watching you do a lot of hard work they see you're sweating a lot you are slogging a lot and you are this ambitious person you are this person with a never give up attitude okay they either they are watching you they are tracking you for because they want to feel inspired they are watching you they are tracking you because they want to uh, either because they want to feel inspired or either because they want to extract something from you okay now now sometimes intelligence is always you know what intelligence if used for the rise right, uh, right reasons it's it's always a boon otherwise it is always a curse okay so what i see is there are some over smart people around you okay who who are watching you very closely and look you know what even if we try to keep uh, our life as a big secret, sometimes because of wrong people, okay, uh, some leakages may happen, okay, you, you are in your, wherever you are in your life, you are succeeding, 
mainly what I see is that you are extremely happy and satisfied or you will experience a lot of happiness and satisfaction and abundance when it comes to your professional life, when it comes to your uh, career, okay? When it comes to your love life, Sagittarius, there is a sort of a void inside you, okay? There is a sort of a void in your life. Uh, why there is this word because because whatever happened your your previous relationships did not work out okay and then there are few people around you who knows that there is this void in your life okay now with that with the ten of cups and with the tower next to one another what i see is that some people may want to use this void as a pretext to uh, to enter in your life okay why they want to enter in your life i told you right some people are watching you you are on the watch list of few people either because they 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 want to feel inspired or because they want to extract something from you they want to use you okay so how to enter in your life either appreciate you or either sympathize you empathize you okay they know that they have this you have this void okay and i'm not saying that you are a stupid person who is going to entertain any kind of Tom, Dick and Harry. No, not at all. You are someone who is very smart. You are coming across as a king, king of wands. Okay. So it is just like what I see over here is there are some people who may rather I would say that universe is trying to uh, warn you beforehand through this spread. That there are some people around you who may want to enter in your life okay using the void that you have uh, have in your life void of love you may not be feeling you may not be even feeling like you need right now anyone because you you are absolutely enjoying wherever you are uh, you are enjoying your life to the fullest okay and no one's life is perfect so but people may use this as a reason or as a stepping stone to enter in your life okay so they may try to portray a picture like yes i'm the one who can give you this ten of cups i'm the one who can fulfill whatever you want i'm the one who can give you what you are looking out for i will fulfill all of your dreams i will fulfill those dreams of you know whatever your dreams are a long-term relationship getting married having a family with someone okay whosoever wants to have kids okay so this kind of a picture will be portrayed in front of you okay but what i see is you are also a smart ass you are not someone like you know uh right away you're not going to allow people to uh enter in your life with such kind of reasons you are also someone who is very good at judging people okay and what i see with that 10 of uh oh, sorry uh, with the tower card next to the ten of cups is you are going to rec you are going to recognize this this kind of shit and i see you removing some people from your life i see you cutting out some people from your life because you are going to see that some people want to be in your life to use you to take to uh, take undue advantage of of you uh, misuse your kindness your generosity or your relationship with that person whether it is friendship or whether it is whatever existing relationship with that person whether it is a work relationship whether it is friendship whether this person is someone from family distance distant family member i see you're going to recognize their shit okay and something you you didn't want it to do but you will have no choice but i see you cutting out some people from your life okay because their shit will be exposed okay either you will come to know what they are doing either you will come to know their intentions or something is just going to get revealed and based on that you will take a decision to cut out cut out these people i see you ending certain situations i see you ending certain chapters in your life okay as far as your person is concerned we have is eight of cups we have is nine of wands and we have is nine of cups yes we have two nines okay we also have tower we also have death and rebirth okay eight of cups i see you closing certain chapters for sure okay certain cycles are getting closed so sagittarius 
even if this is even if someone is getting cut out of your life a wish fulfillment is not far away okay someone is is I don't know. I feel like many people are watching you, <laughs> Sagittarius. Okay, you are seriously on the watch list of many people, and uh, even if one situation does not succeed, I see another situation turning out to be a success. Okay, although you are going to be a bit unsure of that. Okay, you may try to relate. this person this another person to the recent experience that you had but nevertheless even you are going to feel attracted towards this person because they are at the end of the day a wish fulfillment of yours this person is already attracted towards you okay you will find yourself holding back from this person but i don't see you will hold yourself back for long okay I see you getting into a relationship. I don't see you remaining single for long. I see you getting into a relationship very soon. Okay. And uh, yes with that 8 of cups what I see Sagittarius is is that someone from the past is accepting that you are not willing to go back. I see a certain level of acceptance happening uh with the, you know a past person is accepting that uh you want to close this chapter or you want to you don't want to reignite the situation you don't want to go back to them you are not interested in them they are accepting whatever you are thinking okay so with that eight of cups for some of you yes uh, your past chapter is getting closed on a permanent basis okay but you don't have to worry if the past chapter is getting closed because something better is stored for you okay there is there is something good that is really stored for you you have to be happy about it as far as your career your money and your finances are concerned we have a queen of swords we have a two of swords death and rebirth seven of swords and uh, page of pentacles yes again i'm getting a similar energy with that seven of swords what i have described over here some people are watching you because either they want to feel inspired or either they want to extract something from you given the fact that you are rising up and given the fact that you are oozing out that energy of uh, you know that success is not far away or you are a successful person or you are oozing out that a certain level of confidence okay and people are getting impressed because of that and I I see you I see I see when it comes to your career especially if it's a job maybe some of you are not happy with whatever is going on maybe you're feeling like you're being dragged into some filthy politics or maybe you're being made subject to something for which you're not responsible okay subject to something negative for which you're not responsible and you're you I see some sort of an unhappiness when it comes to a uh, uh a job situation okay and i am also getting an energy where if where you are so done with uh people trying to boss around with you okay you are this fire sign and you don't like anyone bossing around you are someone who who likes to be a boss you are the what shall i say you are you have especially with that king of wands i feel like you like leadership qualities are are like stored and stuffed inside you and uh, people around you always feel very insecure because they always feel like they they don't know or rather i'll say your bosses have always felt insecure around you because they because they never they never knew that or they were always unsure Uh, that some day you are going to overtake them some day you'll surpass them so your bosses always sort of uh, made you feel wrong okay or anyone over and above you they always made you feel wrong okay and uh, 
and that is why i see that many of you are ending a big chapter when it comes to your career and your profession maybe you are you will stop doing a job uh, if you are doing a 9 to 5 job i i see even if you have done that for a couple of years i say like 5 years 10 years okay you will be like enough i'm not doing this job anymore i whatever i will do i'll do something of my own and you are already figuring that out is what i'm feeling with the queen of swords you are a very smart and intelligent person sagittarius okay uh, this and if you are planning to take a jump from a job to entrepreneurship this is not something that is happening right now this was the planning was started a year ago two years ago and you are already working on that you are already doing certain things in parallel if you are a if you are an entrepreneur already i feel like there is some level of uh, what shall i say you you are feeling like i need to bring a change in whatever i am doing okay you truly want to feel happy from inside you really want to know what what i can do which will sort of help me rise up okay what i can do which will sort of bring more success in my direction okay you are you are thoroughly thinking about everything and uh, money is looking good money is rising you don't have to worry okay but let me also tell you one thing you are someone who when you when you rise up you are someone who inspire people and then competitors around you also have this urge to compete you and to rise up to copy you so i see even if you will rise up in your life you will face competition a lot okay from your competitors because your competitors will be always on the edge like always on the edge to pull you down to prove you down to prove you wrong okay they will be rather than their own progress they will be more concerned about uh, trying to pull you down okay so that is not going to impact you any in any manner because you are a very capable person overcoming any kind of challenges in your life okay but that's that's what i see people feel triggered when they see you okay i don't know what sort of uh, why do they feel triggered but yes they do feel triggered they do feel challenged you do nothing you are just being you okay but they automatically feel triggered for some other other reasons all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe Okay bye bye then